Welcome to 30 Days on Mount Desert Island. I'm Todd Dunn and it's December 15th. And today I'm on my way to Northeast Harbor. I'm making the trip to Northeast Harbor via Sargent Drive, which is kind of the scenic route to Northeast Harbor, and that it goes up the east side of Somme Sound. You can see the sound behind me here. Now I am in the village of Northeast Harbor, right on the main street that goes through the village center. I'm right now looking kind of uh, north out of town and we'll pan around. There's a real estate company, a bank, another bank, and the rest of downtown Northeast Harbor. So we will walk through and I will show you what there is here in town. Okay, here we are at the first street. This is C Street. And if you walk down this street, you get to the harbor, which I think you can see down there at the end of the street through the trees. And this is one of the main walks up from the harbor. So if you come into Northeast Harbor by boat, this is uh, how you'll get up to town. As we walk through, we're going to see basically what there is here in downtown Northeast Harbor. There's a gas station, which I was probably open. Looks like it has a little convenience store a market across the street. And most of the other businesses are restaurants or, ga or galleries. So there's not a lot that's open this time of year. Which brings up something about Northeast Harbor. This village is a really big summer destination for wealthy people who have summer homes here. As a consequence of that, the population goes way up in the summer and then this time of year drops way down so that there are very few people here in the winter. Here is the Great Harbor Maritime Museum, which I believe is only open in the summer. And we'll just continue down the street to see the rest of downtown Northeast Harbor. As you can see, it's pretty quiet here on December 15th. I had to, I had to cross the street because the sidewalk ended on the other side. You can see where the end of it is right there. And then we just have basically what I think is the edge of a residential property, someone's estate. And you can see there's not much open here. A few shops, but that's about it. This building here, this gray one, is Colonel's. It's a uh, pastry shop and restaurant, which uh, has very nice pastry and a reasonably pleasant restaurant. And of course, it's closed, as are most of the other businesses this time of year. And we're just about to the end of downtown Northeast Harbor. I will be going down to the harbor from here, but before I do that, I'm going to show you just a couple of other features of the town. So anyway, at this point, I'm finished with the uh, commercial part of downtown Northeast Harbor. And as we go over there, we get into homes. Most of them are large summer homes and are not occupied during the winter. Except maybe if someone comes up here for uh, the holidays and New Year's. Before I go down to the harbor, I'm just going to show you a couple other features of the village of Northeast Harbor. We go up here a little bit. Turn here. One of the community centers in the village is the public library, which is right here. It's quite a large library, as you can see. And uh, it's open all year. And in fact, if you come here and want to know what's going on in the village, this is an excellent place to stop to find out. Well, here we are at the waterfront, looking east across Northeast Harbor, the harbor, 
to the east side of town, which is over there on the hills. And Northeast Harbor as a village starts right over there and extends west to Somme Sound. And here we go. You can see lobster boats that are here wintering over at the docks. The large gray building up on the hill over there is the Astaku Inn, which has a very nice restaurant. And the rest of the buildings you see here are all homes, pretty much exclusively summer homes. So here is the rest of the Northeast Harbor Marina, which is a municipal marina. In the summer, this is pretty much completely filled up with yachts. And in the winter, the lobster boat fleet takes it over. And although there are a couple of floats available for visiting boats if anybody wants to come up here in the winter. This boat with the white cover on it is a tour boat that uh, does tours of the Great Harbor, which is the harbor just south of here and goes up into Somme Sound several times a day. And they often have a National Park naturalist on board telling you what you're seeing in the park. So we go looking over. The road going up over there is C Street that we came down. And here is the sort of panoramic view of the shoreside facilities. So this is Northeast Harbor, the harbor part. I should mention down at the end of the harbor, the larger building there is Morris Yachts Shoreside Facility. They do boat maintenance and they're actually part of the Hinkley Company now so I'm not sure exactly how active they are these days. Across here are some municipal buildings. The first one houses the Harbor Master's office and behind that is a visitor's center with information and public restrooms which I can tell you are open in December which is nice. Northeast Harbor is one of four villages in the town of Mount Desert. That pretty much wraps up my visit to Northeast Harbor. Hope you enjoyed finding out a little bit about this village on the island and what it looks like. If you enjoyed my little visit, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't, please subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.